TGE Debe Eagles and Davis Construction Lodge Patriots each recorded big wins in SKNFA Division I action on Thursday at the Kim Collins Stadium. Debe crushed at Newton Ground five goals to one. Ronaldo Benjamin scored a hat-trick in the 6th, 11th and 54th minutes. Ahmad Shari scored in the 30th minute and Josiah Bradshaw scored from the penalty spot in the 60th minute. The lone goal from Newton Ground came from Jonathan Williams. Coach of Dia Bay, Kalia Huggins, said her players executed well. So tonight's game was pretty intense and you know, I am proud of my team though because they basically did everything, well most of the things that I wanted them to do. Um, I was expecting a little bit more than the what, five goals that we finished with and I really wasn't expecting any goal from the opponent but um, all in all they went out and we came out victorious so I'm pleased for now. Coach of Newton Ground Kevin Gerald said there is a lot of work to do though he believes the performance was an improvement so far for his team from last season. Well, honestly speaking it was not bad performance we just started off a bit shaky but obviously um, finishing um, some combination play, we wasn't combining much and shooting, we are working with shooting. In the night's other match, Lodge Patriots made light work of Rivers of Living Water FC four goals to nil. The goal scorers for Lodge, Nick Juan Wilson in the 31st minute, Rashawn McKenzie scoring twice in the 51st and 66th minute and Horan Thoms in the 70th minute. Nazim Huggins, a player with Lodge Patriots, said even though they won, there are areas still they need to improve. Well, um, the team will perform um, very good tonight. I would say it can room for improvement, us passing around the ball better. Um, we just, just need more um, passes and score more goals and we just look forward for the next game. Chad Brown, a player with Rivers, blamed fitness on the outcome of the match. Well, basically, you see, it's an unfit team. This is our first game. We will do better and come again next game. The SKNFA Division 1 continues with a match on Monday at the Newtown Plain Field when Mantab will face hard times at 6 p.m.